two-year-old Pacers parading for race number three, the Illinois top line. And here they are, number one, the pass line, owned by Wayne Puckett of Pittsfield. Jerry Robinson trains. Mike Brink is driving. Two is Nippa's one, owned by Steve Newcomb of Chicago. Tex Motes, the trainer, with Dave McGee. Three, Kentucky Littlefoot, a scratch. Four, Dixie on my mind, owned by Ron Michaelon. Tex Motes, both of Illinois. Motes, the trainer. Andy Miller is up. Five, Scottsdale, owned by Jim and Diella Scott of Mount Vernon. Philip Cotton, the trainer and driver. And six, A.P. Chestnut, owned by Albert Clare. Starkville, Mississippi. Stacy DeRue's trains. Stacy DeRue's drives. Five, Pacers. Number three, Kentucky Littlefoot. Here they come. They're off and pacing. Dixie on my mind between horses for the lead. On the outside, out second is A.P. Chestnut. On the inside, Nippa's one gets away well. Now Nippa's one is second. A.P. Chestnut will duck to the back of the field as they're being led by Dixie on my mind. And Andy Miller by a length and a half. Inside, Nippa's one now second along the rail racing third as they drive toward the quarter, the pass line. Fourth along the rail as they drive that way is Scottsdale and trailing as they reach the quarter will be A.P. Chestnut. They're being led past that station now by a length and a half by Dixie on my mind. And Miller sends the uh, son of Cam Best past the quarter in 28-4. He's now racing down the backstretch. They're headed toward the half-mile mark, stalking the leaders. Second is Nippa's one, the Jaitlow Bell Colt with McGee. Behind them, racing third on the inside, down the backside, the pass line. No move from Scottsdale. He's content fourth. And A.P. Chestnut close up but trailing as they're midway through the second quarter, approaching the half-mile mark. And as they reach that station, they'll be led past it by Dixie on my mind. He's there in 58 seconds. He'll lead him now past the draw gate. Dixie on my mind maintains the advantage just a length. Now Nippa's one second. Right there, third, the, the pass line. No move, Scottsdale fourth. And A.P. Chestnut, single file, no move the entire mile. As this field enters the final turn, they're being led still by Dixie on my mind. Andy Miller. Now a length and three quarters on top. Behind him, Nippa's one tries to keep the gap closed. Racing third, the pass line. Off the bell comes Scottsdale. He's moving from four. And A.P. Chestnut at the back can see them all. They've just raced past the three quarters, 128-1. They're at the top of the lane. And pacing quicker now, Dixie on my mind. And now he enjoys a two and a half length advantage. They turn down the stretch and Nippa's one behind him is second. As they race to the wire, A.P. Chestnut way off the wire, way off the rail, moving uh, wide. But it's going to be Dixie on my mind. Line. Maintaining that two-length advantage, trying to close ground, Nippa's one. Dixie on my mind, Nippa's one. Dixie on my mind by just a length. Second, Nippa's one. Third, the pass line. Four was Scottsdale. Five, A.P. Chestnut. 156 in that two-year-old mile. Dixie on my mind. Race number three, owned by Ron Michaelon of Chicago by Tex Motes of Fairfield. Trained by the very successful Tex Motes, driven by Andy Miller, here's Dixie on my mind. Dixie on my mind, lightly raced, gelded son of Cam Best, Cam Best sire of the brilliant Color Me Best, recent winner in 148, an Illinois-owned pacer, along with several other sub 150 credits cam best as you might recall if you are a regular here paced the fastest mile in the history of harness racing in a time trial and if you look across the infield the rail there right on the left of the governor george ryan sign you'll see the name cam best it was 1993 when the sire of this winning gelding and Bill O'Donnell paced a 146 and one mile. Remarkable performance. No one has been close by about uh, seven or eight lengths. That's the best ever in the sport. So Cam Best comes to mind as his son, Dixie on my mind, is receiving now the race blanket presentation by Miss Nora Ann Rupert, Miss Illinois County Fair in 1999.